Hi Libra, how are you? This is Born with a Veil, and this is your love reading for November and December of 2019. I'm at work, so I thought I'd take some time to do you a quick reading. This is about the person that you're with. I'm going to see what's going on with you in the month of November and December, Libra. Um, this is not going to resonate with everyone. It's going to resonate with a handful. And then you don't know what's going to happen with your relationship in November and December. So I'm giving you a heads up on that. Some of you could feel a certain way now. Um, and it could escalate in November and December if things are not going right. So this is one to two months ahead of time. Okay? So you can't say thumbs down because you don't know what the hell's coming in November and December. That's kind of crazy to me. So just listen to what do I got to say. Please like, share, and subscribe. Um, if you want a personal reading, call me at 313-401-3707. I'd rather have you text me because I might be at work and leave your message. Uh, emergency reading is $90. Uh, tarot card reading is 55 Over the phone is 65 And one card is 15 And that will come to you in a text or I will call and tell you about the card. But you have to go through PayPal. Okay? So let's get on with your reading. So the first card is let your friends help you, and I'm doing reversed. You don't even want your friends to help you. You don't need no extra added advice about what's getting ready to happen within this relationship. And it's best that you don't trust a lot of people with your relationship, maybe one or two or one, somebody that's very close to you, Libra, that you can trust, okay? Now, the person that is in your life, this could be their Venus, Sun, and Moon rising, uh, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, okay? Um, you don't deserve love from them because they're not the right person for you. I'm just going to tell you like it is. You may think so, but they're not. You're going to find out some things about them. Um, stay optimistic about your love life. They want you to stay, stay optimistic because you're getting ready to meet someone new. This person Libra that you're with is not for you. Make the effort. Um, He's going to try to make an effort in November and December to stay with you, but you're getting tired of the bullshit. You're getting tired of it. And you see how you are and you kind of just have your hands there. You're tired of the same old shit, the same old lies, the same old made-up stories. It's safe for you to love again, and you are going to love again. Um, you're not going to go looking, uh, Libra. The man or woman is going to come to you. Now, this person is going to want to have heart to heart conversations, but do you see how he is? See that? That's how you're looking, man or woman, right now. That's how you feel about the person that you're with. And this person is still trying to butter up to you. You're like, I'm sick of you and your bullshit. I'm tired of it. I don't want to hear nothing else. They're going to try to express their love, but you see how he's looking? Male or female, that's how you're going to be looking at that person that wants to express their love. Because it's ridiculous. This person thinks that they're their, your soulmate. They're not your soulmate, Libra. Not at all. You guys will be separated, either on a, from a business trip, or they got to be at work, or they got to go away for work, or um, they're going to go on vacation, or you literally are going to separate in the month of November, December, going into the beginning of 2020. You're not calling in this person as your soulmate because you know deep down that this person is not your soulmate. They think that they are, but they're not. You're not going to get engaged to this person. They want to get engaged to you, but you don't want to get engaged to them. They want to marry you, and some of you do not want to marry them. Remember, this is not going to resonate with everyone. This is just a general reading. You want a personal reason? You have to call me. This person isn't even worth waiting for anymore. Absolutely not. Love yourself first. Some of you are not loving yourself enough to know the difference between that this person, <coughs> excuse me, is not right for you. You, some of you keep hoping and praying that he is or she is, but, ev but evidently they're not. You're going to find out in the month of November, December. Or could be going into January, and that's not that far. Uh, you don't even want to get to know this man or woman anymore because you found out the bullshit. Um, religious factors. 
some of you are mixed and then some of you are with the same culture same color uh, attraction you're getting to the point you're not even attracted to this person anymore Libra there's something about him you're not attracted to and new love a new love is not coming in right now because I'm reading in the month of October so kind of look for somebody around November December January February March um, the fall the winter going into the spring and this possibly could be the one for you that will be coming in. And they're going to be a little bit more playful. You have to recapture romance and allow your inner youth of spirit of fun to shine. Leo, Libra, you can't be so serious all the time. Very soon. Um, you're not even going to clearly decide on what you want right now because we're still in October. But November, December, you're going to start coming around a little bit to fit, kind of figure out what you want. And then you still may hold on to this man or woman because they make you feel a certain way or they're good to you. Um, financial and career, you don't even care about their money at this point. Some of you are just sick of this person. Let go of control issues. They're never going to let go of control issues. Never. In the month of November, December, if you're still with them. They are. Uh, there is deception there with them, Libra. In the month of November, December, going into January, there is deception. They've been lying to you very much, and they're wearing a fake, fake uh, mask. And it's either a man with two women or a woman with two men. They're too co. They're too codependency on you. They want you for every little thing. You're sick of it. You're tired of it. You're going to free yourself in the month of November, December, going into January. Chemistry, there is still a chemistry there with him, with you, but you're kind of like, uh, you know, forgive and learning. You don't even want to forgive this person anymore. And children, you have no children with them, most of you. Like I said, you're dealing with a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. It could be in their chart. You do not trust them whatsoever, Libra. True love. This person is not your true love. Flirt. Um, I think the person is too mean or too angry to flirt with you, but the next relationship you will flirt in November and December. You're going to have romantic feelings in November, December with someone new. Pay attention to the red flags with this person that you're with now in the month of October. There is no unrequited love with this person that you're with. There's not even no healing for you to do with this person anymore because you don't care. Um, release your ex. You're not going to release anybody at this time, Libra, about any of your exes. You're not releasing any. You're almost like at a standstill. You're not going to give this relationship a chance in November and December going into January. Uh, you're not going to keep an open mind about this person anymore. There's no passion between you two. Hardly any sex. Past life relationship. You have not had a past life with this person. Absolutely not. And there will be no reconciliation with this person. So bottom line, Libra, in November, December, it possibly could meet someone new going into the new year. But I don't see you being with this person up the long haul. This person that you're with is not good for you, Libra. They're full of shit. Uh, they're big liars. Um, they're deceitful. Watch who they say that they're living with. Um, that could be a lie. Uh, you don't know where they're going when they're not with you. Um, you don't know who they're talking to when they're not with you. There's a constant lies coming out of their mouth. Libra, especially if you're dealing with, especially if you're dealing with someone that's got cancer in their chart, or Scorpio, or Pisces, or they are that, or they're Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, okay, uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Aquarius. I mean, they got they got a mixture of signs in their chart, but um, no, you got a lot to deal with with this person that you're with, Libra. So November and December look better. If you were to get rid of this person, you would make room for the new person to come in. But as long as you got this person in your life in November, December, January, February, March, 
um, this new person is not going to come in because you're still holding on to this person. This person may be very nice to you. This person may be gift giving. This person may be doing a lot of things for you and helping you. But this other person is not going to come into your life until this person is gone. Okay? So that is your reading, Libra, for November, December, going into 2020. God bless you. And sorry for the boxes in the background, but I am at work. Thank you.